Welcome back. We've got a lovely story for you now. As Scott Morrison packs his bags and leaves Kirribilli House, it's obviously not lovely for him, <laughs> but someone else is getting evicted, unfortunately, too. We do promise this is a lovely, it's lovely story. It's lovely in the end. <laughs> it is in the end. It just takes a while to get there. It's like Jaws. <laughs> Good in the end. <laughs> well, the Morrison's former pool cleaner was given a place to stay by Jenny Morrison earlier this year after her own home was impacted by flooding. And now as the Morrisons come home, Nikki Durant is preparing to move out. And Nikki and her mum, Thelma, join us now from Sydney. Nice to see you both. Hey, Nikki, this was really lovely of the Morrisons to give you a place to stay. How did that all happen? Oh, um, I um, gave Jenny a call from the Northern Rivers oh, probably a week after the floods had hit. And um, I knew her house was empty and um had furniture in it so i rang her up and said i'm in a bit of a pickle can you help me out and and how was she with all that um yeah yeah she was pretty good she was pretty devastated for me mm. and um she said look you know I'll, I'll i'll have to talk to scott but let me get back to you and then then she rang me back and said um uh, you can stay there till the end of May, uh, until election, that's election time, because uh, obviously we don't know what's going to happen then. So mm. May is what I went with, so here I am. Wow. Hey, Thelma, what do you make of this? What did you think when you heard that the Prime Minister and his wife had offered Nikki a place to stay? Well, I thought it was fantastic. I knew Nikki was going to ask her if she could move in there. Uh, because she had nowhere to go and she knew the place was vacant. So I sort of knew beforehand that Nikki was going to ask. It's, it's a hell of a thing to do, um, mm. which is really wonderful of, of Jenny to do. What do you make of her? Uh, she's such a genuine person. Um, she's, she's very down to earth, so easy to talk to. Um, when I came down here, she came, walked me through the house and she bought new bedding and stuff for me. So Gee, she's, she's just a gorgeous mm. woman. And mm. um, I, I know previously, and I don't know the circumstances, but I, when I was doing the pool, I did speak to the neighbours and they had stayed in their house at some stage as well and they helped them out. So that's yeah. kind of where mm. I got the idea from, to be honest. Mm. It's, um, it's the side of politicians that we don't hear about yeah. often enough, isn't it? That they, um, they are kind-hearted. Yeah. That's yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, people beautiful. just don't understand all that. You know, they don't know. And it's, you know, great that they did it. What are you going to do thanks, now? Thanks to them. Mm. Uh, now I'm, I'm heading back up to North Woodburn. Uh, my house is ready to be rebuilt. I've got Giprock up there. I've coordinated a few things from Sydney. Uh, I've had the house assessed, so it's ready to go. I've, I've made a makeshift kitchen on the back veranda. I've got a camping mm. mattress up there. I'll, I'll be sleeping on the floor for a bit, but I'm quite happy to do that. It'll be like glamping to me. Uh, Tell you what, we're just looking at all the pictures oh, um, we'll, um, of either. the flooding and also of your home and the amount of damage that it's suffered. Um, but hey, look, Nikki, I know that you're taking your pool business up north. So for all pers um, prospective customers, have you got a bit of a sales pitch for us? Oh, oh, jeez, they caught me off guard there. I'm, <laughs> I've been cleaning pools for 20 years. I don't really have a sales pitch. That's oh, maybe it. Maybe you can shoot <laughs> one at me. Have you got one, one I can use? Uh, I've been cleaning pools for 20 years. Nothing more said. Mm, boom. Give us yeah. a call. That's yeah, your but, pitch. Uh, look, I will be offering uh, free water <laughs> testing up yeah. there. So all you people in Evans Head, Woodburn area, I'm coming up. Good on look you. Look out for me. Sharky's mm. Pool Service. Sharky's Pool Service. I'll be, towing a, I'll be towing a boat up for her. Oh, true <laughs> story. Oh, <dear. laughs> Well, look, you've, you've both been through an awful lot. Um, this mm. is, as I said, it's a nice story uh, of how giving some people are, no matter in what house um, they live in. We appreciate you coming on our show today and best of luck, huh? Good luck. Yeah, thanks, Carl. Thank you, thanks, Carl. Ali. Thanks, Ali. Good on you, legends. Thank you.